the hood like an engine block. Dude, that rhetoric you spit, I ain't hearing it. What's up, my people? This is Showbiz the Dope. Joe, the juggernaut Joyce, is he here now? Has he arrived? Before I get into that, let's have a message from your friend and mine, the keeping it real guy. Man, I don't know about Joyce, but Stavern came in looking like a little butterball. He looked like he looked like butter bean, but a black man. He looked like he looked like butter pork and bean. So the juggernaut Joyce has he arrived? Well, he just had a fight against Stavern last night, and Stavern he came in. 273 pounds. Just a big, heavy guy who couldn't really move much and didn't have much stamina. He was actually fully tired, extremely exhausted by the second round. And that's because to keep the juggernaut off of him, he put a lot of mustard on his punches, throwing a lot of overhand rights, but they were landing on Joyce. And that's the big thing. Joyce, he has a huge gap in his defense. And it was exposed once again in the first round against Devern. Or Joe Joyce just wasn't concerned. Either way, he walked through his punches just like the Juggernaut. Who is going to stop us? Me, Juggernaut! What I was impressed by was Joyce has very fluid hands. Him throwing the combinations he was throwing, the variety of punches, and how they just came out very effortlessly with power just showed a lot. And here's the thing about Joyce. From my understanding, he was a cheerleader, uh, uh, art student, uh, a triple jumper. Uh, I think he was a, a, a running back for the Pistons, uh, a, a first baseman uh, for the Patriots. I mean, this guy has done it all. He is like a man of many things, and now he decided to box. On top of that, being an Olympian, earning the silver medal, look, he has a lot to work with. I do like the canvas that we're going to be painting on, but is he really going to do much in a heavyweight division? I think so. There's another guy, another heavyweight right now that's doing a lot, who doesn't really have the best technique in the world, but a great athlete, and that's Deontay Wilder. So like I said before, the landscape of the heavyweight division is wide open for great athletes. If you're going to come in 273 pounds like Stavern, or you feel you could just be a big, heavy, heavyweight and not have to move much, you're going to have guys like Joyce who can do a no-hand cartwheel beat on you for six rounds and TKU, or a guy like Deontay Wilder just jump in and throw wild shots and knock you out. If you can't move with them, they're going to really be successful in today's heavyweight division. So let me know what you think about Joyce. Were you impressed? Uh, was I impressed? Well, for today's landscape, I think he's going to be successful. So let me know what you think. Comment below and show biz the dope. Woo. Oh, it's looking natural now. Oh, it's looking natural now. Listen to yeah. Showbiz. I'm out. Boxing. What's better? What's better? All boxing is better.